What up, Lizard Gang? So, welcome back to the channel, guys. In today's episode, we're out here in Las Vegas. Uh, we're right by the Rio Hotel and Casino. And we're about to go to into the tunnels. Or I'm going to try to go and explore right here, these tunnels right here. I see an opening on the other side. But I'm going to try to get an interview with these people that live in these tunnels right here. The homeless, a.k.a. the mole people. I don't know if they're friendly. I don't know if they're not friendly. But um, I'm just going to try to approach them with... You know, just being courteous and be like, hey, man, you guys want to do an interview? If they don't, I'm going to just leave them alone and take off. But it took me a little bit to find this place. It was kind of hard. There's no instructions on the Internet. I just seen a couple of YouTube videos and I was like, you know what? I need to go down there. I need to go explore. I know the Lizard Gang would love to see this. So, yeah, let's see if I could get down here. gonna be a bitch to get back up huh so if I make it then I'll be good if I don't then you know what anymore at least I got you guys a little bit of content you know how can I get down there I want to ask that vato right there that I seen right now if um If there's any more tunnels, I wonder how far this one goes though. Let me see, I'm gonna just walk my my bike down there. Hopefully these fools don't get offended though, you know? I need to take a liquiazo too. Maybe if I take a leak right here, they'll think I'm one of them. See if they don't drag my, my brake out right now. They're gonna be like, oh damn, look at that bike. I bought some uh I brought some some uh some flashlights in my backpack. I don't know if it's gonna be enough though. Oh shit, I didn't want to alert anyone that was here. My light's not turning on. Oh, there we go. I'm going here. Oh, it smells like burnt in here. It feels like warm in there. Let me get my, my flashlight out. I don't know if there's any dangerous gases in here though. You know? I don't wanna be more intruding in anybody's space. Maybe I'll just go not too far in there, you know? Let's go. Am I still rolling? Yeah, I'm still rolling. Look, and I brought an extra flashlight too, just in case. I hope I don't find no dead bodies or anything in here. Can you guys see? All for YouTube. Hey, you guys better give me a thumbs up too, though. Yeah. Man, I need another light. I got another light, but it's in my in my bag. How can people live in here? Look. Ooh. I think this is like a downhill slope. 
see my rolling. Yeah, we still rolling. Look at all that. Got some tagging right here in the wall. I don't want to go too deep in here. Seems like it's just going downhill. Look at that, that's a big ass crack on the, on the top of that wall. Look at that. Look at all the tagging. Oh look. Seems like there's somebody hanging. Camping out over here. Oh yeah, this one's blocked off. disturb anybody in there and be like what the hell are you doing in here huh look at that can you guys see the light at the end of the tunnel yeah then people be camping out all the way inside here that's crazy huh guys and it feels like right now it's 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 kind of cold out there when i stepped off my vehicle it was like 62 degrees but it's warm in here. It's crazy. Let me take a leak, yeah. So before I take out it, take off. I'm gonna edit it out though. You know what I was thinking before I came in here? I was like, I'm gonna get me a spray can so I could put TFTS. You know what I mean? Tell us in the streets or lizard hunter on the side of the the wall right here. I don't know. We got a collection of cans right there. Hmm. Well, some people put barriers up. How's it going, sir? Hey, how's it going? Pretty good. I'm just out here trying to explore these tunnels. I seen them on YouTube. Yeah, not much to explore here. Yeah. What's that? You can't get out at the other end anymore. Oh, you can't? No, it's all chain closed. Been like that for a while. Is this your home right here? No, this is uh, somebody else's home. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. Can I ask you a couple of questions? Sure. Yeah. All right. How about it? Yeah. You know what? I think I see you on YouTube, bro. Well, you have. Believe me. I'm I did a little bit of research before I came yeah. out here, and I was like... I've been down here for about nine years. So oh, yeah? Yep, I just gotta go get my social security card out of here. Oh yeah? And how long? Which I, I whenever I feel like going getting that, you'll be like today. Okay. But they have some housing for you or what? I have uh, like $390,000 in change in the bank. Okay. So, uh, oh, you have 300000 in the bank? $390,000. Woo! I have monthly income, I guess, SSDI. Yeah. See, I've been stuck out here homeless now for like 14 years. Okay. My money's been going in my account for 14 years. Yeah. And I had money in it when I got here. Uh, I used to love my, all my luggage, all my luggage is sold on a Greyhound bus, my ID, my passport, everything. Going to basically welcome to Vegas for $27 in my pocket. Where are you from originally? New Hampshire. New Hampshire? Yeah, and I have a 15 year old daughter I haven't seen in 15 years. Yeah, what brought you all the way out here? Uh, just cheaper rent and the weather. I, I used to live out here. Okay. I had no idea. You had your own apartment and all that? I own a town Oh, okay. Um, I, uh, I had no idea that, like, uh, my shoes are gonna get stolen. And now yeah. you've got no ID, it's extremely difficult to get an ID. When I say that, it took me 12 and a half years to get my birth certificate. Yeah. That's brutal. I mean, and uh, help us out in the tried to help me, and Catholic Charities, and the police, and uh, none of that shit works. 
Yeah. What's all this on top? Is it because fire, of somebody had a fire? Someone had a fire yeah, down here? Yeah, oh yeah, it happens all the time. Well, oh. Not anymore, but when certain people stay here. Yeah. Like the is there a lot of people that stay in here? Uh, there's probably 15 or 18 people. Right now? Yeah. Okay. Like Do er, does everybody like clean their own tunnel? Everybody has their own tunnel. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, okay. Yeah. For sure, there's really nobody between here. And are they all pretty friendly or are they hostile? Everybody's friendly. We just try to stay out of sight and out of mind. I mean, you get caught down here by the police, you go to jail. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, and then, like, these clowns up here at night have two 5,000 gallon taker trucks and they just empty water in the wash all night and flood us out. Okay. Uh, which is like, I don't get that, but whatever. And that's not even the city, that's just people up there renting the property. Is this the only way that you could access this, this tunnels or is there. You can go through. Is there others? Oh, these tunnels go all the way from, fuck, they go all the way past Maryland Parkway. It's a flood channel. Yeah. Is there other, like, other places like this where people live in them? Oh, yeah, all of them. Okay. All of them, everywhere. All of them. But this is the most famous one, huh? Because this one's all over that. YouTube. I'm, I'm, maybe. I mean, uh, like Swenson down there, University Center Drive. If you yeah. have Flamingo, that, at one point, there's probably 125, 150 people living down there. All right. There's quite a few down there now. Uh, if you go up to Valley View, all those tunnels have people in it. and if you keep going up the wash to Arville, our, all those tunnels have people living around hmm. um, and then like at, at Walgreens if you all the drainage ditches you see all the drainage things Walgreens around this area right here right up the road just Walgreens, okay right up across from the Rio okay so close, right there that intersection that, that Valley View intersection all, people live down in all the uh, storm drains too okay uh, other than that though anybody around here every there's new laws there's not anybody from here to Tropicana or past Planet 13 everybody's gone and I don't know where they went, but they're gone. There's no camps left. They just like evaporated, which is messed up. But there's new laws. Like yeah, well, I've seen everyone scattered like everywhere in the city right now. Oh, yeah, well, uh, yeah, well, not around here, though. And like, it's illegal. Like, I can't even go to Las Vegas Boulevard. It's against the law if you're homeless. And they're trying to make it against the law to be homeless. Okay. But if I go to Las Vegas Boulevard, I go to jail for six months because it's illegal for me to stop, stand, sit, or anything on the boulevard. So if I'm at a crosswalk, what am I supposed to do? If I'm standing in an elevator with people, at, what am I supposed to do? Walk circles? Yeah. I mean, you're waiting for the elevator. What are you supposed to do? Like that's pretty fucked up. I mean, I don't get that shit. And then they'll like give you an order out where they ban you from the whole boulevard and around the boulevard mm -hmm. for you know two years, five years. If you get caught in that area, you go to jail for two years or five years. I know a lot of people have gone to jail for that. Like it's brutal. And how can they, how can they ban you from a public sidewalk in a free country? where your tax dollar goes to maintain that piece of property. And if yeah. it's private property, then why is there a public bus route on it? Exactly. That, that's reality though. I'm not trying to be a smart ass there, but those are true facts. Yeah. Um, but that's not what they want to hear. And like, if it don't work, you're not breaking a law, they'll write a statute. That Nevada revised statute law, in my opinion, allows them to rewrite the constitution. Because like, you go to jail for not breaking a law. These like statutes, like blocking a public pathway in a resort corridor. That only applies to Las Vegas Boulevard. That's like sitting on the sidewalk or something, you go to jail for that. Um, it's against the law to have a shopping cart even in your area to the store property. And before it was against the law to push a shopping cart on the sidewalk that had a store name on it. How about this? It's illegal to go in the parking lot up here, above us in this plaza right here. Yeah. If the businesses are closed, it's against the law to be in the parking lot and they'll arrest you. I got arrested for picking up trash like, I'm always picking up trash. I don't even know how many times, four or five times, the rest of picking up trash. That solar panel don't work no more or uh, what? No, I mean, they, uh, they used to be a solar panel place up here. Which one's your tunnel? The next one over the here. One the one across the street? Yeah, right here. Yeah. It's like my tunnel's clean, it doesn't have anything in it. All right. Um, but can we get a tour of your tunnel? You can take a ride down there if you want, go for it. Have yeah. It. There's nothing down there, you go down. I got a pregnant cat and uh, Loco's down there when I keep sleeping though at the bend. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, you, uh, take, you can take a ride down there and then. Uh, how deep is it? It goes, it comes out at the uh, high roller. Okay. The link, if you walk quick. Oh, the at, link, the link. A, at okay. the link. Okay. Yeah, if you uh, walk quick, it, you can be, you know, come out at the link valet is where it comes out. You can get there in eight, eight minutes, nine minutes. Eight minutes? Walking. This is an e-bike, so right, well, I'll probably saying, be probably there, in there in four minutes, maybe? Yeah, you'd be quick, but there's dirt and shit, but you would be fine. Yeah. Um, but you can't. Is there out. any uh, toxic gases that come up in any? It's, it's not a place to be living. At any it's time? Like it used to be when the police would come, they could only come in at 250 feet. Yeah. But now they'll chase you clean through the link. They used oh, to, and they used okay. to wear hazmat suits when they come in. Okay. But that's a change on the change of laws on that. 
mind you, if like we got people died on here this year, and uh, well, there, yeah, people died for sure. But if you have somebody like this, like you know, needs medical attention, like an ambulance, and they're in here, like just by that trash can, yeah, the, the paramedics won't even come in. You have to bring them out. Oh, okay. It's unreal, mind you. Uh, the police will chase you clean through the link, but I mean, so it is what it is. Whatever the laws are, or statutes are. So people would. Yeah. Back in the days when they were in trouble, that people would run in through these tunnels well, I used to run and get away from the cops. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. Like, why? If you stay, you go to jail. If you run, you yeah. probably don't. And like two of the cops had missed eating shit, chasing me so bad hey. they had to go back and change their uniform. That's cool though. You know, it's that's like some spots. Batman stuff right There's there. Some slippery spots back there. If you know it's slippery, you still yeah. may go down. And when I say slippery, fucking brutal. And uh, if you were to run onto that full speed, I can't even imagine how fucking hard you would go down and how far you would slide. <laughs> Never mind, you have a hell of a time to run you. Do they have any solar panels that work? Um, or are they all messed up? I don't know. I mean, you can get solar panels pretty easy. Go to any solar shop and I get yeah. them back, just pick them up. It's only anybody here is paying for shit. Nope. Look at, let me, let's go explore this way. Damn, dude. Yeah, this one right here. Did you put like this barrier here? Try to close it up a little bit. Hey, this is the cleanest one though, too. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. Look at all these tunnels, guys. Out of every single one of them, that's the cleanest one right there. And then this one right here. Look at this one. Damn. And there's a purse right here. Empty purse. That's crazy, dude. So the tunnels ain't that bad. People make it out to be a little bit worse than it is. I'll run down there and tell Loco you're gonna go down there. Where on on this side? Uh, my tunnel, I'll run down there first and let him know you're gonna ride through there. Yeah. Like fucking, is his, his name's local? Yeah, I don't know if he's a racist. Crazy? Damn. Alright. Yeah, yeah. Is he a big guy? No, he's a small guy. Alright. I don't think there's any big people down here. Nope. Not at all. I'll run down there quick. I'll be right back. Alright. So I'm gonna go right around over here. See, guys? These people ain't that bad, you know? They're just uh, going through some rough times, homie. You know what I mean? Look at they had a little barbecue thing. Look at that. Look at he quickly disappears, look. Bam, he's gone. That's crazy. Let's go this way. Let's go see what's cracking on the other side of the tunnels. I feel like we're riding all the way through, guys, but then I don't know if I should. You know, I feel like I'm putting myself at a little bit of risk in a little bit of danger. That guy's pretty cool. I see them on YouTube a lot of times, but you never know how the other guys are. What the hell? My bike ain't even turning on. Oh, there we go. Let's go see what's cracking. That fool said that I could ride all the way across and I'll come up at the link. The next day or the next mission is probably going to be that, guys. I want to go all the way to the link. But I'm going to have to have someone come with me because you never know. Someone watching my back and I could watch their back. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, chili bean? Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah, I made it. Look at that, right here by the Rio, homies. Hey, on YouTube, it seems like there's a lot more people. But I guess, yeah, they be going up under there. You can't see anything when you go in there. All right, homies, hey, if you enjoyed this video, 
make sure to give me a thumbs up if you guys have any other places you want me to explore um just name it bro as long as it's in the u.s and it's not that far from arizona uh if it's a neighboring state texas uh new mexico colorado anything like that then i'll go explore out there and i'm trying to like um travel and, and get a lot of footage from different places in the country so yeah just drop it down in the comment section if you guys like this video give me a thumbs up because you guys never give me thumbs up come on guys we could do a lot better than what we've been doing all right so with that being said and done i'll check you guys out later peace